So this area is called Skazka Canyon. Now Skazka is literally the Russian word for fairy tale. So you'll sometimes see it labeled as Skazka Fairy Tale Canyon. So kind of like that English fairy tale, fairy tale canyon. Um, but the name really does apply because what you're looking at is perhaps it does remind one a little bit of the Badlands back home. But what it is is it's carved out by weather and erosion into some truly amazing shapes. And we'll get a chance to see some of that later on. If you'll look up there a little bit, you'll see kind of a double ridge line. Mm -hmm. There's actually a walking space, a bit vertical, but it's nevertheless walkable. Okay. In between there that allows for some amazing views, both of the mountains off to the south and southeast, okay. and also of the lake off there, Issacol, off towards the north and northwest and then the mountains themselves farther out along to the border and then Kazakhstan on the other side. Okay, all right, so let's get started. Nope, we have to go around. Go That's around. Me. The mud puddle? Yeah. That's why we're wearing boots, isn't it? Okay, yeah. I think we can through that from up here. Oh, wow. Yeah, there's the lake from up here. Yeah, the view just keeps getting better and better from up here. Oh, just wait. Yep. Lake Isakol down there. Yep. And behind that, the mountains of the Tian Chan. Yep. Strictly speaking, those are still the foothills. Yeah, well, they got white caps on and they're mountains. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> but in this part of the world, they got a whole other standard that we said Jeff says they're foothills. I disagree. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I wish I'd have been filming this when I came up over the ridge so I could have heard the original unadulterated wow but and this is pretty amazing Isn't yeah I was looking forward to this one I saw some of the pictures of it when we were overseas and yep. very very cool it is it really is this is super slippery down here Abby so just be careful yeah yep in years past I've taken some clients down this path uh-huh but I'm not sure I want to do that today there's a tourist way up on top of the ridge there, and he's being circled by ravens. I'm not sure if that's a good sign or not. I would say no. In medieval times, the raven was a harbinger of death. Yeah, I believe so. So, you know, maybe it's time to come down. Should we hop across this, or? Yeah. Okay. Yikes. Yeah. I can. All right. Well, that's not as solid as it looks. You know, a good gully washer will turn this stuff to goo. No, I'm not. Oh, you're not that skinny. I think you are, but. Well, fine. <laughs> you're going to stay out of this discussion. You're going to stay out of this one. Take the hat. Oh, your hat's not skinny enough. I see. Okay. And they're not breaking this. No, don't break your phone. Don't drop it or anything. Coming up there. All right, here we go. Oh, it's very crumbly. Yeah. Um, let's see. How can nope. I? Nope. Uh, yeah. Y'all be careful now here. Y'all be careful now. Nope. It's probably just as well. If you'd gotten stuck in there, it might have been a neat trick. Are you calling me fat? <laughs> Why, no, I would never do that. Jeff just called the client fat. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, there goes this TripAdvisor rating, yeah. Y'all come back now live, here. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, big key ingredient there. Well, this is the view from the top. You can see Lake Isakol way off in the distance there. Very neat. Very cool. It's a beautiful spot. Abby, you're on camera. What do you think? This is awesome. Yeah. I, you can't say I don't take you places, right? When have I ever said that? You haven't. I'm just saying you can't say it. 
<laughs> and here is the view up here. Wow. Yeah. You actually said, wow, you must be pretty impressed. Yeah, it is a really good view up here. That's what I was hoping. Yeah. I've never actually been to this particular spot. Oh, this is a neat view down here too. We haven't seen from this angle. Yeah, up here is a good spot. There's just so many, so many neat angles and they change every time you take a few steps. Yep. Yeah, we're going, we're, I think we're going up, aren't we? Yeah, we're going up. This is different from what you see in the Badlands because you don't get those vertical yep. hard rock faces there. Badlands of South Dakota I'm referring to. Yep. That's a weird looking one up there. Look straight ahead. Yeah. We are back at the parking lot after our hike. Hey, Abby. Hey. And I'm really hot, and I get hot really easy. And I said I would like to jump into Lake Izzacol, and I'm told it was very, very cold. And I consider that a bonus and uh, another reason to do it. So I think we're going to go down, and nobody's going to join me, so that's even more reason to jump into it. You sure you don't want to go in, Abby? Yes, I'm sure. You're sure? OK. Well, let's go try to do that. That'll wake you up though, right? What? That'll wake you up though. Well, right? and as you get out of cold, oh God, as you go off farther, it gets colder. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh. There's one seriously deep lake too. So that's it from the Ferry Canyons and Lake Issacol today. Tomorrow, actually tonight, we are off to Caracol. We'll see what there is to see there. Anyway, catch you later.